Southern style is special because it's really all about your guests. It's about the people coming to your home. It's about the memories. It's about the laughter. To me, that's what Southern style is. Right, and right, speaking right. of paying attention, unfortunately, there are not so pretty things that we have to think about, too, when we're having a party outside. This one still has a very pale blue ceiling, the Haint Blue, which one of my favorite Haint Blues is called Borrowed Light from Sherwin-Williams. But when I have my guests come, they really, they can't believe it. They go, my God, you went all through this, you know, to make a beautiful dinner. The event today was amazing. We were thrilled to be part of the dinner um, theme and th Southern style. And of course, seeing all the Southern decor and all the exposure to how to dine and everything, it was actually very, very nice to, to see that compared to our Canadian style. I can't wait for next year for this event. It's gonna be, if this year is any indication as to what next year might be, it's gonna be great. I can't think of another place that you can come and get expert advice and food and wine and, and, and putting flowers together and, and all these different things, handpicked by Priscilla to, to kind of just package it all and give it to you. And, and I just, I couldn't imagine not coming to this. The dinner was fabulous, of course. I keep saying that word because everything is fabulous. Um, but it was great. It was um, very well done, very organized. Um, the food tasted amazing. And uh, we really enjoyed it. Got it to meet a lot of people from all over the country and the world, really. Well, the South is known for its glamour and elegance. And this is a great way to see it all. Not only the flowers, but the designers and the food and the fashion. It's what makes the South what it is, and why Elvis kept coming home to Memphis every year. But uh, orchids are the number one house plant, so everybody wants them, everybody has them, they just don't know what to do with them. <laughs> now we have to give away this lovely orchid. Yes, right. This is an actual Priscilla hybrid that I brought here from Virginia. <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations. I don't leave the nuts out. <laughs> You're smart. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of, uh, of green onion there, and then just a little bit more mayonnaise. Do you uh, find some oak in this wine? Mm. Um, so when someone talks about buttery and oaky Chardonnay, um, there's a reason why that is, is what that is. We had people who really are very well known here in Memphis and throughout the South. And they were able to teach us so many things, floral arrangements. We had the bridal, beautiful couture bridal outfits that uh, Pat Kerr has made. We had so many, so many guests that it was a huge success. The guests seemed to love it. They were here for every event. It was three days and they want to come back and have more. Priscilla is an amazing host. Uh, she couldn't have been more gracious and, uh, and more real. Um, and I think that was one of the neatest things that I think that has come across in this entire weekend is that she's just a lady like uh, everybody else. And when Elvis would sing, he wouldn't just sing the song one time. It was over and over and over, and she got a sample of yeah. that. I'm now designing uh, bridal gowns that have had a deep influence on my career, one of which is Princess Diana's, and I've just finished it. And it is, the, the train is 20 five feet long. Oh. This is actually a suit that I designed and made for uh, mm -hmm. John Hamm for, for John Draper. Nice. But just sort of going back through the photos and looking at my research and it's so it's so similar. I, I'm glad I was accurate. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Stuff you guys and then again you're transitioning to winter. Exactly. Um, so that's a... Oh, wow. So what this actually is and I want to make this comment only because 
I know this, and sometimes people just don't realize, make sure you add water when you do the fresh flowers. And there'll be a few <laughs> other... Our panel, It's Fall, y'all, was amazing to give so many do-it-yourself crafts and moments for people to take home for Thanksgiving, Halloween, the autumn seasons. It was really special and also teaching some people some new traditions with a little modern twist that is just a great way to bring family and friends together during the holiday seasons. I don't like to cook, which I'm kind of surrounded by all this stuff. I kind of, but in my family, if I pick the restaurant and I pay for it and I drive, that's called a home-cooked meal. So, um, <laughs> truth, it's truth, it's the truth. I love the interaction with the fans. I love them telling me what they like best. I love the fact they want to come back here to Graceland. The experience was not only for fans who have been coming year after year, I mean, people were coming from all over the world. We had people from New Zealand, people from Australia, from Ireland. I think she, Priscilla needs a television show, in my opinion, and she did a wonderful job. She's an articulate person. She just treats everybody, you know, like, just like a, a family. Well, we had an event called Bellini's and Bites, and that uh, was very close to the stables. It was a beautiful day. The dinner was unbelievable. We had outside seating arrangements. Dinner was served toward the end of the day. And I went to all the tables and visited who I could, most of the majority of the people sitting down. And it, it was very intimate. Intimate in that I even got to know more of the fans. I was able to sit at the table and welcome them and ask them questions about, you know, how did they hear about the show? How, you know, how they felt about it, who they brought with them. And, and we had a lot of mother-daughters that came. And actually we had a lot of men as well, which I was pleasantly surprised. For the fans who attended this year's event, I want to thank them very, very much from the bottom of my heart. They made, they made our weekend, not just mine, but Graceland. 